Hello everyone, and welcome to another exciting episode of Box Bricks with Bruce. Today we try our hand at our second box of 001 Bat Memorabilia. If you remember yesterday, it was not pretty. The Herbe Bobblehead gave its sign of disapproval, and so did I. We ended up with three serial numbered cards and a lot of damaged cards due to the stickiness on one of the stacks. Today, I don't think we can do any worse than yesterday. Let's get down to breaking, and of course to wrap it up at the very end, we also have a couple of loose packs of 1415 Fleer Ultra, just to numb that pain from yesterday's break. Let's get ready for box breaking! Here's hoping today we get something. Alright, once again, start with that left side. Oh. Will you hear that? That's right, we got more stickiness again. I think just to save some time, we won't be doing the base cards so much today. Alright, though this pack is a complete write-off. All bases and lots of damage due to uh, the stickiness there. So at least it's all base cards. See a good example here, Robert Dome base. Lots of re residue and stickiness taking it apart there. So go on to the next pack there. Unfortunate, but uh, again, it's part of the risk when you're buying an older product made of certain uh, certain materials. Ah, oh, it's horrible. Okay, this one wasn't as bad. Um, Jeff O'Neill, Felix Potvin, Steve Valaket, Josef Stumpel, Patrice Brisebois, Ziggy Palfi, Aaron Asham, and Tom Poti. This one kind of messed up because of stickiness. So, if we're lucky, it's going to be a similar trend as yesterday, where uh, only the one stack was sticky and the rest were uh, nice and loose. But, we can hope, we cannot guarantee that. Oof. So, this one is all base cards, some kind of not pretty. Um, and of course, we ended up with another one of the Trevor Linden uh, Foundation Autograph Redemption offers. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. Perfect example of how badly sticky it is. Again, this is old base pack. Um, <laughs> take a look at this, just carefully trying to take it apart. This is the end result. So, again, it's a garbage card. I'm not even gonna list it if it's so bad. Again, if we're lucky, it's just the one side like yesterday. If we're unlucky, it's the whole box. Oh, lovely. Just lovely. All garbage. Again, we got an insert Brad Stewart, but take a look at this. Huh? Look at that. Lovely. It too? Garbage. Can't do anything with it, can't trade it, can't resell it. Good stuff. Again, if we're fortunate, it is just the one stack. Fortunately, no serial number cards again. Next stack, same thing ending up with loads of cards damaged due to stickiness. So, so far I'm disappointed in this box, but again, we might be lucky um, and have non-sticky second and third. Okay, yes, perfect. Okay, we'll go the rest of the way. These aren't sticky, just like yesterday. Mark Eaton, Michael Pekka, can't explain why it's always that top left stack. John LeClaire, Brian Rolston, Teppo Newmanen, Damon Lankow, Eric Nicolas and Stu Barnes. So, okay, one stack was not pretty. We lost a bunch of base cards to damage and one regular insert. So, so far at least, uh, the rest is just fine. Thank goodness. Imagine if we got like an emerald parallel of Patrick Waugh and that was destroyed. Oof. Doug Waite, Guy Hebert. Brent Sopel, Alexander Karpovtsev, Sergei Krivokrasov, Alexander Selivanov, Jocelyn Thibault, Brian Merchment. Alright, so we're actually doing worse than yesterday now because the damage cards are way more severe and we have no, uh, no cards of note otherwise. Oh, got some stickiness. Awesome. Jeff Friesen, Chris Joseph, no relation. To Cujo, uh, Robert Svela, Bates Battaglia, Alexander Digg, 
Never remembered him with the Rangers. Talk about a draft bust, though, eh? Jeff Fodkosh, Dean McCammond, and we have Parkhurst insert of Felix Potvin. Always a fan of Potvin. Kind of a, an average goalie in reality, but had a heck of a fan following, and the value carries on to this day with his cards. Made a lot of good money off of his, uh, his particular items. So no serial numbered cards yet. We're saving something big, I bet. Sandus Ozolin, Adam Deadmarsh, Jonathan Gerard, Oleg Saprikin, Jason Allison, Patrick Kielberg, Sean Burke, and Ray Bork. Come on something. After yesterday's nothing, we gotta be able to get something in this box. But it's looking like all base today. <laughs> Boris Mirnov, Martin Broder, Paul Laus, Freddy Modine, Nick Poynton, Yanni Herme. Sure, some of these are rookies. Again, no huge value with any of these guys. Gino Ogic and Michael Nylander. You find that rookies don't really seem to hold their uh, value from this particular time period in cards. Memorabilia and bigger hits, so they hold it extremely well. But when it comes to rookies and stuff, yeah, not, not so much. We're getting destroyed here. All base cards again. Oh well, quick go through. Michael York, Frantisek Caberle. Got the cup winning goal for Carolina in 2006. Pierre Turgeon, Pavel Dimitra, Steve Ruchin, Bill Muckelt, Brian Holzinger, and Aaron Gavey. Yes, Aaron Gavey. Okay, we got more stickiness again. We'll try and free these up the best we can. We won't even mention the damaged base card. We'll just go over the ones that are fine. Marcus Ragnarsson, Adam Graves, Marty Baron, Milan Hayduk, Theo Fleury, Mike Fisher, and Brad Isbister. Some stickiness, again, all base again. Peter Bondra, Yarmer Yager, Darcy Tucker, Radic Dvorak, Tard Marchant, Jan Bulish, and Peter Schaefer. Okay, so we have no serial numbered cards, we got no memorabilia cards, and we have one insert that had to be disposed of due to heavy damage, and one of those Trevor Linden Foundation cards. So it's uh, unbelievable, but we're actually doing worse than yesterday. So. Huck out the bad ones that are damaged and can't be useful for anything. Sergei Brilin, Jeff Nielsen, Mika Alatalo, Ladislav Noy, Jonas Hoglund, Mike Johnson, and we have Ruby Parallel numbered 103 of 200 of Alexander Selivanov. Again, it's an Euler that's fortunate because I live in Edmonton and Euler stuff is pretty easy to move regardless of the player. Unfortunately, on the whole, it's still Alexander Selivanov. Urbe's verdict on the Selivanov Ruby. No, um, we're continuing that trend from yesterday. Not exactly the best players. But that could potentially change here. Any moment. Dicky cards. Again, we'll throw out the bad ones. All right, so we lost a few cards in that one to damage. Anders Eriksson, Thomas Holmstrom, Andrew Burnett, Mike Richter, and another insert that will unfortunately be going to the garbage pile, Chris Grattan. Again, you can't pull these apart when they're stuck together like that. You can do it carefully, you can do it violently. At the end of the day, it's still stuck. So we've lost two inserts to garbage, so we're doing terrible in this box. Alright, we lost half that pack due to damage. Josef Baranek. These are the ones that survived. Patrick Eliash, Mark Savard, David Tanabe, and Manny Fernandez. So on the plus side, we don't have damaged serial numbered cards or anything. On the minus side, still a lot of damaged cards and we lost some of our inserts as well. Okay, some more stickiness and we lost a few more. Peter Svoboda, Ray Whitney, Michael Hanzus, Darren McCarthy, Maxim Balmochnik, yes, 
This is one I've never heard of in my life. Derek Morris. Okay, final stack. Hopefully we end up with something interesting and hopefully there's no stickiness. Just destroys good cards. Okay, mostly good on this pile here. Peter Forsberg, Jucha Lind, Ed Jovanovski, Kent Manderville, Jean-Guy Trudel, Sylvain Cote, Chris Chelios, and Todd Simpson. So, we have one serial numbered card so far. Ouch. <laughs> Oy, oy, oy. Okay. Anson Carter. Ron Tugnut. <laughs> Cliff Ronning. Wade Redden. Tyson Nash. Chris Pronger. Andre Savage. And Parker's insert of Ray Whitney. One of the salvageable ones. Woohoo! Okay, so we're still not doing too well here. At all. Did not think we could do worse than yesterday, yet here we are with bunch of damage cards and one serial numbered card. Gary Roberts, Marcus Nasland, Brian Savage, Jürgen Janssen, Martin Straka, Donald Odette, Scott Thornton, oh, didn't know he was with the Dallas Stars, that's interesting, and Timu Solani. <laughs> Final three packs. Oi oi oi, this was not a pretty box. So far. David Gosselin, Jeff Sanderson, Fred Brathwaite, Patrick Laleem, Victor Kozlov, Mike Ricci, Kim Janssen, and we have Ruby Parallel, number 103 of 200, Johan Davidson. I have no words. Um, Urbe's verdict. Yeah, no. Um, didn't think we could do worse than yesterday in our hits, and well, the box delivered on that. Not only are the hits worse, we've also lost several cards to damage, so here's hoping the last two packs here will change things around for us. Not looking promising, however. Brian Campbell, Martin Skula, Brett Hull, Peter Sikora, Chris Gratton, Sean Hill, Mike Rathji, Robert Esch. The last pack. Uh, I, I don't have words for this one. Absolutely terrible, terrible box. Steve Kelly, Sergei Zubov, Phil Housley, Nicholas Sundstrom, Kip Miller, Vinny LeCavalier, Vitaly Yachmanev, and we have Sapphire Parallel 98 of 100, Nicholas Sundstrom. Urbe's Verdict. No, again, of the entire checklist and the names that are in there. Nicholas Sundstrom, come on. So before we grade the box itself, let's hopefully bring up our mood with our last two packs, with our two packs of 1415 Fleer Ultra. Frankly, anything is an improvement. We have Jonathan Huberdeau. Oscar Clefbaum, Brandon Sod, Patrice Bergeron, Patrick Kane, and Gold Medallion Parallel of Craig Anderson. Okay. Cody Cece, Andrew Shaw, Milan Lucic, James Van Riemsdyk, Jay Boomeister, Claude Giroux. If I had a less family-friendly YouTube channel, we'd have some real choice words for this break here today. Urbe's verdict on our box of 001 BAP memorabilia. Yeah, no, it's nowhere near a passing grade on that. Serial number cards were terrible beyond belief. <laughs> Maybe make a buck back out of this box. Um, lots of lost damaged cards. It ain't pretty. And then our Fleer Ultra packs are just pretty much base cards, so we kind of did poorly. Unfortunately, that's the nature of the beast. You win some, you lose some, and you get dirt kicked in your face on others. Until next time, have yourselves an excellent day. Bye-bye.